Hey guys, Chris and Martha here, and today we have a treat for you. So over a month ago, Chris and I, we were at the 2021 Alliance Rally in Elkhart, Indiana. One of the vendors there is Moride. So Moride wanted to do an interview with Chris and I because they've never seen a mobile garage gym. So this is gonna be our interview with Moride. And then once we were done interviewing with Moride, we took a uh, tour of their plant, which you'll see a little bit of footage on that. Uh, so I hope you all enjoy the video and it's neat to get a, a different perspective on what we're doing from a third party vendor. Yeah, and a huge shout out to Moride and thank you for the video, thank you for the interview and allowing us to put this on our YouTube channel as well. Hey, we're Chris and Martha Peters and we are full-time RV living with a CrossFit style high-intensity gym out of our 42 V13 toy hauler. Uh, this crazy idea started back, uh, I would say probably 15 years ago. Martha and I have always decided we wanted to go full-time RV living. Um, about 2016, uh, I became diagnosed with type 2 diabetes and had really poor health. And so we decided to take on a fitness and active lifestyle and combining the lifestyle of fitness and the joy for adventure and travel. Um, Martha pushed the issue and decided, well, you could tell. All right. I told him one stipulation for us to go in full-time RV living is I want a mobile garage gym. So fitness is very important to me for mental health and as well as rehabbing injuries that I've had in the past few years. So it was very important for me to have a mobile garage gym and being the wonderful husband that he is, he said, absolutely, 100%, let's do it. Uh, we decided to go with the Alliance Valor 42 V13 specifically because it offered a true living room and a true uh, bedroom, but also gave you a really flexible space in the garage. And one of the unique things is the two side, uh, the side patio and the back patio. So it gave us more workout area. So it maximized our space. And then specifically Alliance for a brand just because of their customer service and how well they do responding to problems when they come up. So some of the equipment that we bring with us on the road is we bring a variety of bumper plates. We've got about 600 pounds of bumper plates. We have both a 45 pound barbell and a 35 pound barbell, uh, which traditionally is usually a 45 for men, 35 for ladies. We have a plyo box, which is made for stepping and jumping, uh, explosive movements. Up on our side deck here, we have a Concept2 rower. I've got an ab mat for doing sit-ups. I've got a kettlebell here. We have both, uh, Martha and I each have our own kettlebell, like a 53 and a 35. We have different bands that we use for stretch, uh, stretching and for strength and overall exercise. We keep different types of jump ropes depending on what we're doing. This is a Concept2 skier, which uh, represents Nordic skiing type exercises, so a very much a pulling exercise. We have another ab mat, which Martha uses, and then we have adjustable dumbbells. Uh, due to the limited space of a toy hauler, we have adjustable dumbbells versus having a complete set for each person. We have stacks of adjustable plates, so more bumper plates depending on what types of workouts, the weights will vary. Of course, no gym is complete without music and a timer clock so we have a clock so we can keep track of our time on our workouts and that's how we know where we're progressing on the back deck we have a concept two biker which is very much similar to a spin bike uh, along the lines of like peloton we have an assault air bike elite which is just torture <laughs> this this fine machine uh, is great for cardio kills you uh, another set of adjust adjustable dumbbells that we use and I'm sure this wasn't what they intended the ladder for but we have a couple different functions here we hang uh, rings off this and the rings are set up so that Martha as she's progressing into pull-ups can use these as a scaled version of a pull-up and then we also have medicine balls 
which we throw up at that target for our multiple different workouts, but we call it wall balls. So you use the medicine balls to throw there. So that kind of completes how our gym is usually set up. And then we will go station to station, depending on what we're doing and what our goal for the day is. Yeah, what's great, another reason why we picked the Lions Valor 42V13 is because of the back deck and the side deck. So the steps allow us to go down and we do our interval training. So we can go from the bike, jump down, go over there, uh, use our bar, lift our weights, and then come back up. So it's really great. Chris usually goes on the side patio. I choose the back patio or we have the bike set up. And sometimes we work out in the most beautiful views ever, uh, overlooking lakes and just some remote areas. It's really nice. Hey guys, Chris and Martha here. Thanks for taking a tour of our mobile garage gym. And Moride actually let us take a tour of their plant here in Elkhart, Indiana. Yeah, we had a blast today going through. We learned a lot about the manufacturing process that they use and the attention to detail and the quality. The products that they had on display were awesome and we had a great time looking through and seeing exactly what's available and what's to come in the future. One of the things that uh, we absolutely loved uh, that more I put onto our trailer and Lions utilize is the side patio and the rear patio. And we have the steps that attach. They work out excellent. They're solid aluminum and you don't get any flex. And then they also double as support for our patios when we have them out. That was the reason why we chose the Lions Valor 42V13 because of the side patio and the back deck. I love the railing and they utilize every space on there. Yeah, some other railings are cut off in the corners and it gives it almost like a hexagon shape on the back. Our Moride system is a complete to the edge and it locks in at each corner and it works excellent and feel nice and safe with it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed our video. Let us know in the comments what you think about our mobile garage gym. If you got any suggestions on how we can improve it, we're always open to that. Give us some feedback, let us know. And again, thank you for your time and watching. We truly appreciate you. Don't forget, like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time.